So I just wanted to make this quick video to show you how to use the new recommendations. When you log in, you'll probably see a screen that looks something like this. When you're done with the diagnostic, you can come here. If you look at these, um, your student can choose any of these skills to work on, but there are a few differences that I wanted to point out to you. First off, you'll see that some of them have this little flag here that says from the diagnostic arena. Those are diagnostic recommendations, okay? You can click on that little flag and it will only show you the recommendations from the diagnostic arena. I would highly recommend doing that so that that way your child is only practicing the things that they need to practice. Another thing, you will see that some of these skills have this little triangle here. That stands for math recommendations. Some of them have a little book that stands for language arts. If you want your kid to just do math, you can click on this little pyramid and it will only show math recommendations. So now I have it set up so that my sample student here is only seeing skills from the diagnostic arena and they are only seeing math recommendations. So now I can be sure that as long as my student stays on this page here, they are only practicing skills in math that they um, still need to practice. Now, if at any time I want to go back and do some language art skills, I'm just going to come here, I'm going to click on that little pyramid. Now it's going to show all of the recommendations. So I can scroll up or down until I see this little book. Click on that. And then it's showing me only language arts recommendations. So then I can let my student go and do that. And that's all that they'll be doing is language arts from the diagnostic arena. I cannot set that up as a teacher. You have to set that up um, on your device. So I would highly recommend that you go through when you're done with the diagnostic, follow these instructions to set it up so that it's just from the diagnostic arena. And then you can choose either language arts or math that you want your child to do based on, you know, what are they supposed to be doing at that time? Are they supposed to be doing math or are they supposed to be doing um, language arts? Let me know if you have any questions and um, good luck. I really appreciate your hard work on this.